What's a noise gate? And do I need one? Yes, you do. So what exactly does a noise gate do? Well, it gets rid of this sound. While still giving you the output of the guitar that you do want. Now, if you tend to play a lot of metal type music, you probably either use a lot of gain or have a high gain amplifier. With that being said, you're going to need to know how to adjust your noise gate levels correctly, as well as set it up in your guitar rig properly. Now, there's a lot of noise gate based pedals out there, but for this demonstration, I'm going to be using my ISP Decimator, since it's one of the more common noise gate pedals next to the Boss NS2 and it's used by a lot of metal artists to date. So let's learn how to properly set up a noise gate into your pedal board. As you can see here, I have my ISP noise gate pedal right here and my Super Moon Reverb pedal right here. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is connect the guitar cable into the input of the noise gate pedal while the output from the effects pedal or the end of your signal chain goes into the input of your amplifier. Or if you happen to be using an effects loop, your effects loop send will go to the input of your noise gate while your effects loop return will go to the output of your effects pedal or the end of your signal chain. Now that we've got set every noise gate covered, let's learn how to properly adjust it to your liking. For this demonstration, I'm going to be using my EVH5153, which is a very high gain amplifier head. Okay, so now I'm going to show you some examples of what exactly a noise gate pedal can do for you, especially if you're going to be playing some metal type music. Thanks guys for watching my video and hopefully I was able to help anyone out there that was looking for some tips in metal based gear. And be sure to like and subscribe and comment any questions you may have or any future references you may have for some Metal 101 videos. Thanks guys.